Centers for Disease Control says everybody should receive a flu shot. It is approved for ages six months and up, uh, and there are several different uh, preparations available depending on your age uh, and if you have any other complicating medical conditions. The flu vaccines are safe and effective, and reactions to them are, are typically mild and self-limited, usually a low-grade fever, perhaps some achiness, certainly a lot better than actually getting influenza itself. Uh, the shot, uh, flu shot, we have a lot more experience with, uh, so it, that has that in its favor. Uh, the flu mist is approved for only a limited age range, uh, I want to say ages 2 or 3 up to, uh, I think it's 49, something mm -hmm. like that. So it's just the specifics when it's approved for. It's also not approved for people who do have asthma, uh, so uh, if you're somebody who really does not like shots especially, uh, although the flu shot is a, a minimum of some discomfort there, uh, again, to give you and those around you a little bit more protection, uh, the flu mist may be an option for you as well. Children too young, uh, again, it's not approved for ages under six months, uh, so the recommendation is that everybody around that baby get their flu shot, so we provide a little cocooning, so everyone around, uh, parents, uh, caregivers, grandparents are protected against influenza to decrease the chance of your child getting exposed and picking up a case of influenza. In addition, moms that are pregnant during the flu season, the recommendation is they receive a flu vaccine during their second or third trimester. Some of the protection they get then passes on to the baby, gives that baby a few months of protection until they're old enough, age six months and older, to start receiving flu shots themselves. The Centers for Disease Control says, one, wash your hands, two, don't touch your nose or your face because that's how you pick something up and put it in there. Cover your cough with your elbow because you usually aren't, if you cough in your hand, you're not always washing those hands frequently. Keep away from sick people and if you're sick, stay home and avoid, avoid other people so you don't get them sick as well.